it's Wolf Girl here, and today I'm coming with a Toys R Us haul. I know, another one. But today I had this activity where they're giving away free stuff, and then I bought one thing, and I think that you really, that you guys really gonna like. So anyway, all the, let's start with the free stuff from the activity. So the activities were consisting of basically just giving free stuff, racing, electronic race cars, and hula hooping. So I'll get to that hula hooping part. There's something about the hula hooping. And I'll talk about it in a minute. So, I got two of these for free. I was supposed to get only one, but the guy gave us two, so, yay. Oh, and they're different colors, too. I didn't realize that. Look. That's cool. And then there's this crown. Statue of Liberty. So it was a 4th of July party. Um, then I got this glow-in-the-dark bracelet. And the thing is, like, if you could hula hoop for more than 10 seconds... Like, if you keep the hula hoop up, like, keep the hula hoop from falling off your waist for more than 10 seconds, then you'd get this. And I did it for 15 seconds, which was pretty good. I haven't done, like, I haven't looped a hula hoop in a while, so that was pretty good. And then you got this. The original gazillion bum, premium bubbles, which I'm not sure what it is. I'm going to open it and find out. Oh, okay, I get it. It's like, it's kind of like a beach ball. Oh my god, it stinks of plastic. I'll, I'll tell you later. There's no way I'm putting that in my mouth. It stinks. Alright. And are you ready to see the best thing I got? The snacking Noodles Baby! Oh my god! Oh, that should be a music play. The snacking Noodles Baby! Oh my god! <laughs> Anyways, I got the snacking Noodles. I could not help myself. I just had to get her. I'm not sure what I'm going to name her yet. I might think of something before the end of this video, so don't comment names, comment name suggestions. Uh, one, of my, one of like my biggest pet peeves is that when people comment name suggestions, when I already say, I have a name, or her name reveal is, and then people are like, name her this. One of my biggest pet peeves. Like, let's say I'm like, I already know her name, and then when someone's like, name her something or another. There's other time like, her name is, let's just say, Ashley for now, and like, name her Zoe or something. Oh my gosh, it's, it's weird and crazy. But yeah, without any further ado, I need to get the scissors and get this baby out. Oh my god! You do not know how long I've been waiting for this moment. Hours, basically. Anyways, I'm going to start with cutting the tape. And while I'm cutting it, I need to say something interesting. She says mommy and daddy, so that's really cool. It's a gender neutral toy. I need to ask Owen over sometime, show her to him, and be like, hey, look, and then she'll be like, Daddy! He'll freak out. Okay, I got the tape. That was really easy, actually. Oops. More tape. Oh, this tape is not very good. They're making their packaging a whole lot cheaper. Oh my gosh, there's a piece of tape back here. Come on, tape. Please undo. Come on out! Come on, baby! Please, I just want to play with you. There's a ton of tape. There's more than I got. One sec, guys. I know you probably can't see anything. Okay. Now I should be able to get her out. Okay, yes, she's finally coming out. She's finally... This box is falling apart in my hands. Oh, come on! Please, there's another piece of tape. No. Nah. Ah, yes, finally. Okay. Oh. Sorry about the clouds, guys. I'm lighting. Instructions. Let's take a look. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, that, 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 okay. We, we, you don't need extra instructions. Who needs extra instructions? This king, I'll read them a little bit later. First, I want to get her out. So let's start with her accessories, because that's normally the easiest thing to get out. So, we'll take that. Look, there's already one out. And now there's... Okay, that was a little bit harder than I thought it would be. But that's out. That's out. That was easier than I thought it would go. This plate is not going to be easy, and I can just tell by looking at it, it's not going to be easy. Oh, that was actually a little more simple than I thought it was going to be. There were two wires around here. Oh well, that's her noodle making thing. Now, 
to figure out all this mess. Oh, look, her dress is in there. <laughs> I'm gonna cut her neck wires first. So. All right, that's that. I'll cut her feet and arms free. Oh, she's already talking. She has an adorable, she has an adorable voice. I'm thinking she's going to be three years old. That's just a little sneak peek at her age, guys. But I have to honestly compare her because I don't have a baby this size yet. At least I don't think. I have to compare her to the others. Okay, I just need to take this part out. Oh my gosh, this is probably the most entertaining part of the video for you guys. I'm so glad you're entertained. Oh my god, this is so boring. Sorry, guys. This is... She's... She's honestly not really tied in many other places. Just around her body, and that's it. I didn't have to cut that tape, I don't think. Okay, there we go. She's out. That was actually, honestly way easier than my last baby the baby go bye bye <laughs> way easier i was expecting it to be a struggle just like that okay hungry, hungry. so here she noodle, is noodle. she's on demo right now <laughs> she's cute i love her dress though like it's adorable just take a look at this here can we take a moment to appreciate her dress it's adorable hmm. oh okay <laughs> she looks like a baby that might be able to stand on her own but she can't so that's that's okay but little baby bummer Anyway, so she's got this switch on her back. This is on. Oh, wait, no, oh, no, that's off. This, this is a little boy, right? Oh, oh, you guys can't see. Okay, so there's. How do I make it so you guys can see? You guys can just barely see. I'm gonna put you guys right here. There we go. This is demo. This is off. She's off right now. Like if I push it down, that's that's demo. That's a little boy symbol, and that's a girl symbol. When you switch it on the girl, mommy noodle do, I love you. So you hear that? Here, let's try that again. Mommy, mommy noodle do, I love you. So she says that, and then when you say it on the boy, daddy, daddy noodle do, I love you. So she says daddy. <laughs> so that's really cool. She says mommy and daddy, makes it a gender neutral toy. So, for people like Owen, they can enjoy baby lives even though their baby lives are, like, for girls, basically. Anyways. So, she's got really curly, high pigtails and curly bangs. Oh, she's super cute. This is actually the first baby I haven't messed up her hair while she was in the package. That's crazy. I might keep in her bands for a little while, but I'll probably take them out at one point. Anyways, here's her diaper. We're going to put it on her. Oh, and by the way, you press her belly to make her talk. She doesn't have a bracelet, so you can't press anything like on her wrist or anything like the older dolls. So we're gonna put her diaper on. Is she even? Is she even on? What am I doing? Oh, wait. Okay, she's a little muffled because the diaper's over her speaker. But here's this hairbrush. You can brush her hair with it. Brush her hair. <laughs> Her curls are falling everywhere. Um, we have this little bowl. It has like plastic noodles, fake noodles at the bottom. And we have this noodle maker thingy. And the noodle dough. So let's make her some noodles and watch her slurp them. Oh, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's the stuff. That's that's so squishy. Oh my god, that's squishy, that's squishy. Oh, it's it's warm, it's warm. Okay, well duh, it wasn't my warm car, so. Duh, it's gonna be warm. Duh. Where's your logic, wolf girl? I'm gonna put some in here. And I'll put you guys down so you can see. So, and then you press this thing. Look, and here come the noodles! Ah oh, they fell down. Alright. Open this thing up. Oh, whoa, this Play-Doh's stuck in there. I think I put a little too much. Oh, okay. Well, you can just pick it up with the Play-Doh. That's no big deal. By the way, this noodle dough is Play-Doh. Well, those are little short noodles. They're like mac and cheese.
already. And it's cloudy again. I'm so sorry, guys. The clouds cannot make up their mind today. Blah. And I'm just making a bunch of noodles right now. Nothing too special. I have heard this dog gets really like, gets clogged really easily, but hopefully she won't get clogged. And if she does, I can show you another one of her features. I mean, I probably wind up showing it to you, showing it to you anyway. But yeah, I need to pick this plate out. I think that's enough noodles for her. What do you guys think? Is that enough noodles? Okay, good. It's enough noodles. Okay, there's Play-Doh stuck in there, but I'll get it in a minute. And okay, there we go. I got it out. Never mind. Ah, Play-Doh gets stuck in here kind of easy, which is the only bad thing about it. But it's fun. It's fun to squeeze the noodle, noodle, noodles out. Okay. Also, her head turns, which is cool. Um, let's give her a kind of long noodle. That's so funny. Yummy in my tummy. Okay, here's another one. Oh, she likes these. Also, oh, she's got a noodle stuck in there. Okay, I got it down. Also, well, when she says I'm full, you can still. You can still feed her, but she'll eat noodles laying down too, which is interesting. Okay, eat some more noodles. She gets full kind of fast. She ate like only a few noodles. All right. Change diaper. Okay, fine. I'll change your diaper. Okay. probably clogged oh no that actually turned out better than I thought it would is there anything up there no there's nothing up there actually okay that's weird so I got pretty much all the noodles off she didn't eat too much well she's kind of smaller so I guess she wouldn't eat that much anyway I don't know I love you mommy love you too now here's another thing I'm gonna take her dress off can I take it all the way off no it won't. The vocal doesn't go all the way off. Okay, I have no idea what she's slurping. Okay, well... This thing I heard that you can just... Pull... Pull down and she'll open. You know, I'm gonna turn you off. But I heard that you can just pull this down and... Out and that unclogs her, but I can't seem like well, and that opens her back so you can get the stuck noodles out. But I can't seem to do it for some reason. I don't know why or what's going on. Mine does not want to do it. Okay, I'll figure it out later. Anyways, I'm gonna get her clothes back on and bring a couple babies in here and do some size comparison. And then maybe get. Maybe make her eat some more. <laughs> because she barely ate anything. I'll put your dress back on. Also, might change her as well. She's kind of chunky. I just realized. Look how chunky she is. Anyways. Yeah, that's all trash. Anyway, sorry about that, guys. My mom came in. Anyway, so here's Skylar, and here's Maxine. Skylar's four, Maxine's three. And when you lay them all out, she's about the exact same size as Maxine. So I don't know if I want to make them twins or not, because I don't know. They don't really look like twins, but... And of course, obviously, Skylar is bigger. See? 
So I'm not sure. She's probably going to be three. But I honestly don't know. Yeah. I actually honestly, to be, like, to be honest, I thought she was going to be the exact same size as the My Baby All Gone. Which is about 14 inches. But she seems to be about the same size as Maxine. And she's like 13 inches or 12 inches. Or maybe that's how big the baby, My Baby All Gone is. I don't know. You guys need to tell me if you have the Magical Scoops doll or the Ready for School Baby. And in comparison to your My Baby All Gone, is she basically the same size? I don't know. You guys going to have to tell me. I don't have the My Baby All Gone. I kind of want her, but at the same time, I don't. I don't know. Like, you know. Anyways, I need to think of a name for her. Okay, guys. So I decided she's going to be three years old, and her name is going to be Michaela. So this is Michaela. She's twins with Maxine. I have too many sets of twins, but oh well. So, this is Michaela. So, thanks for watching. Please click like and subscribe. And in the comments, let me know what's your favorite thing from the Toys R Us haul. I like the balloons and Michaela, of course. We'll see you guys later. Bye! Way more. Look, I took her hair down. Look how curly it is. Also, look, she can suck her thumb.